Hey guys, it's Tit and Tag. And welcome back to Jank Play. Yeah, uh, Tomb Raider 3, baby. Which one's next, top or bottom? Okay, before heading out again, use the crowbar you found in the cavern. Ooh, that's a good point. With the pool and snowbanks to open the padlocked door at the end of the walkway near the wall on the middle level. Inside, you'll find a lead acid battery, which you will need later. Wait. Oh. If you don't care about secrets, skip the next section and climb down to the ground. Pick up the walkthrough with the lower level minecart. I don't, don't have anything in my inventory. What happened to my crowbar? Did you not? You, I, you opened. You used I it. used it, but like. Yeah, it just goes away. I guess. That's fucking dumb. That's so annoying. It's so sad. The lower level minecart. Yeah, just go, just uh, go down or something. Like yeah, top or bottom mix. <laughs> Uh, okay, when you're ready to explore the lower level, get into the minecart there and go. Duck as you pass under the two girders at the top of the hill. Okay, I have to. Uh, yeah. I have to. <laughs> Gotta. Got you it. know how it is. Mm -hmm. At the top of the hill, there are two girders I have to d duck under? Yep. Whoa. Um, then immediately stand and swing the wrench to hit the switch. Okay. You succeed in hitting... Uh, in hitting the switch, the cart will follow the tracks to the left. Duck under the no. next girder. Fuck. Fuck. There's no way, man. No way. I needed to hit the switch, so I'm just gonna start over. Might there. as well. I don't care to see where this goes. <laughs> if we ever play any Lego games, we should try to 100% them. Especially if they're the older ones, like the Indiana Jones ones and stuff. That sounds hard. That's super easy. That sounds super cool. <coughs> the newer ones. <coughs> Hard as fuck to 100%, but the old ones, so easy, dude. Doink! Oh! Did it. Okay, if you succeed, okay. Duck under the next girder, but don't break or you won't clear the gap with the tracks ahead. After this, the track curve around the left, duck under two more girders, then get out on the right when the stop cart stops. Duckies! <gasps> yeah, no, 100 percenting uh, <laughs> 100 setting Lego games is super, super easy. Freaking, the only one I've started and I haven't really 100 percented is Lego Batman, because I just haven't played it that much. And Lego Pirates of the Caribbean, also because I just haven't played it that much. Wow. Pathetic. <laughs> Literally, that's it. Uh, enter the hallway perpendicular to the track and press the button to open the door. When you walk, when you go through, the door closes behind you. That can't possibly be a good sign. <laughs> Follow the passage and slide down a ramp into a dark room with steam coming up from the floor. That's it. You landed on the set of an alien movie. Okay. Oh. Okay. Uh -huh. <laughs> Head away from the chain link fence. As you approach the doorway on the right side of the hallway, a super mutant, mutant oh. charges out. Can I just run away? Uh, if you have away. grenades to spare, backflip away while firing, and you should be able to kill it with three grenades. Otherwise, keep moving uh, and it and kill it as quickly as you can uh, with other weapons. I have grenades. I just didn't want to kill it. <laughs> I didn't want to have to. You, you know? gotta, you gotta do it. I didn't want to do the roar. <laughs> what is that, bro? <laughs> Shrek. Not like number one, but like three or something. Oh, yeah. super late. Yeah. I've seen the third Shrek movie once, and that's it. Yeah. Do the roar. It's because some stupid kid was like, it's my birthday, do the roar. And everybody was bothering him, and so he roared really loud and, and to scare everybody, and everybody was like, yay, we love you, Shrek. And he's all like, kill me. Roar! One, two, two. I think I just fucking missed. I think you did. Ugh. Did you get him? I missed twice, I think, too. Fuck. Jeez. Whatever. I don't need grenades. Yeah, who needs them? I probably could have killed him with my trusty pistols. He doesn't deal that much damage. Uh, if you light a flare here, you'll notice some goodies under the floor grates. To get them, follow the dark, twisted side passage from which the mutant emerged until you come to a crawl space on the right. Crawl through into the area below the floor of the steamy rooms 
and pick up shotgun shells and a rocket. Oh, you should have given me grenades, fucking bitch ass. <laughs> As you do this, another super mutant passes overhead and runs into the passageway where you just were. Ugh. Turn around and kill you. Jeez. Oh, there's a shotgun. Shells. Was there anything else? Just the rocket and shells? Yeah, just the rocket and shells. Just the rocky shells. Cool, I love being able to see. <laughs> Who turned off the lights? <laughs> Who turned off the lights? You're right on top of it. I know, I was pressing the button and she wouldn't pick him up. She couldn't see him. Fucking yeah. apparently. Drink. Can I just kill this mutant from this hole? If I have to? Mm, no. Fucking better be able to do this. Turn around and crawl back to the passageway. Laura won't target the mutant while crouching in the tunnel, so crawl out and kill it. Kill it Again, three your age should do it. Yeah, well, they didn't last time. Remember, you want to conserve Desert Eagle ammo for the final boss. Ah! I'm pretty confident I can do it. I guess. <laughs> like, pretty confident I can do it. <laughs> Later, idiot. At what cost? Uh, a med pack or two, maybe? And I have a shitload of those, so... You know. You trapped yourself. Child like rats. Oh, there he is. Okay. One med pack, and I <laughs> killed him. Then continue along the twisty passage to the steamy room, only now you're on the other side of the chain link fence. Cool. Can't see. Walk so far. Run, run, run as fast as you can. God, I wish it wasn't so fucking dark, dude. Oh, can't see nothing. I hate this. Luther! Luther! Climb the long ladder to the top and dismount on the right. Is it a solid snake ladder? Could be. <laughs> Is it a fucking Metal Gear ass ladder? No, it's not. Okay, Press the two buttons in this hallway. The first opens the exit back to the track. You'll return here shortly. The second button opens another door. Good door. Go through and follow the hallway to a crawl spruce. Crawl in, turn right, and continue up a long romp at the top. I can't tell if it's like weird misspelling or if that's just you talking. Which one? Uh, most of them, honestly. <laughs> Probably. Alright, this is the one I go through? So you push the buttons. The first, okay, the second button opens. And you go through and follow the hallway to a crawl space. Okay. The second button? Here's sure. a crawl space. Yeah, I'm going to assume this is right. Crawl in, turn right, and continue up a long ramp. At the top, turn around and drop out of the crawl space into a small room with a window. Mm -hmm. I have to turn around every time. I know, it's fun. It's good fun. Turn around, face face into the room. Ignore the door on the right as you now, for now, and advance with weapon drawn as you approach the far door. You'll see a super mutant run past the windows as it comes around toward you. As soon as the door opens, start firing and back clip away from the mutant. Alright, fuck. It's not in the wrong ah. direction. <laughs> Come on, dude. Shoot him. Hey, fuck. I don't know if he can. Yeah. Kind of seems like he can't. No, he seems kind of kind of stuck. Yeah. Hey, buddy. Where you at? There oh he no! <laughs> oh, oh, he's dead. Yeah, so he couldn't get up there. I don't think he dropped something. So, yeah, exactly. When he dies, collects a small med pack and Uzi clips. Newton drops, and the Desert Eagle clips near the door. Dude, I have so many Eagle clips. Good, you'll need them all. I got pissed off at that fucking flame trooper earlier, <laughs> and I fucking wasted him with my deagle. <laughs> <laughs> Head outside and around to the left toward the small room with the winch. Stand with the winch mm -hmm. on Laura's left and swan dive into the freezing water. I don't remember how to swan dive. <laughs> swan dive, Brandon! <laughs> swan dive! <laughs> swan dive! That wasn't a swan dive! Fucking whatever. Retrieve the winch starter from the bottom. And climb out above on the left. As you warm up, turn around to spot some more Desert Eagle clips. Oh, right there. 
in the worst place ever. With some fleas. Did you climb up to the left to get the demon goods? We're listening. As you warm up, turn around to spot some more deagle clips and a bundle of flares in a, in a little underwater alcove below the winch. Yeah, that was helpful. <laughs> <laughs> what, I don't know how to swan dive! What are you even, what's that? I flipped an air in the air. <laughs> Literally no idea how to swan dive, by the way. Damn. I can do that though. <laughs> That's helpful. Ah! You're just dead. <laughs> <laughs> How could this have happened uh, to me? I think I picked up everything. I fucking better have. Yeah, I did. Cool. Cool, 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 cool. What the fuck do I swan dive? <gasps> Ooh! Ah! <laughs> I might I might know, but. That was not a swan dive. Yeah, clearly. Thanks, fucking Sherlock. Yeah, you're welcome. I think I know how to sword dive, actually. Do you? I think. Do you? No guarantees Do you? at all. You don't have the demon clips. No, I did. I just picked those up. Okay. <laughs> uh, head outside and around. Hold on, I have to pick up the winch starter again. Whoa. Come on, you knew that. You had to have known Whoa. that. I fucking hey, knew it! How'd you do it? It was with the fucking... Uh, the weird button. It lets me do lots of weird shit. Can I do it while getting out of the water? Okay. No, I guess not. Right. It's that thing that, like... It's the same button that lets me do that thing where I put my legs up over my oh, head and yeah. fucking bend back. Yeah, that one? Yeah. Alright, head outside and around to the left toward the small pool with the winch. Stand with the winch on Laura's left. Why am I reading the same part again? Why are you here? Go back into the building if you don't care about getting all the kills. Ignore the door on the left and return through the crawl space to the hallway with the two buttons. Cool. What are you doing with the Shove up your ass. Then <laughs> 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 go through the door near the first button to get back to the minecart. Hell yeah. Do it. I'm going, I'm going. If you do want all the kills, press the button on the left of the crawl space. Yeah, absolutely. Immediately drop weapons as you backflip off the ledge and start blasting the super mutant. That's <laughs> Anyway, so I started blasting. <laughs> <laughs> that starts to sound. Go through the door and just open the press the button to open the door there. Jump across the gap above the ladder and go through the door on the left to return to the mine coot. Alright. I'm at the mine coot. Grab a crystal if you oh. didn't get it before. No. Then get the, get into the mine cart and head back to the junction. After cresting the first hill, duck under a girder. Then quickly stand and break for the next sharp curve. Break! Break! Climb the next hill, ducking under another girder near the top. Then immediately stand to whack the switch. This will send the cart into onto the track straight ahead. You'll pick up a save power. Chris will return to the junction. Okay. Yoink. Oh. <laughs> it's gotta like break your legs or it's, some shit. Yeah, I know. Like she's, seriously. She's unfazed. For by real. Golly. Alright, well I'm just gonna assume that the top one's next. No. Follow the catwalks to the upper level. Get into the minecart there and ride up a hill around a curve to the right and drop the other side. Man, and down there. So right exactly where I thought we were going. No. I should have saved. Hold on. <laughs> Hold on. You can still. I can still, so. Same game. <laughs> right in the middle of doing this. <laughs> uh, don't break for the curve, or you won't be able to clear the gap tracks at the bottom of the hill. Mm -hmm. And then you gotta duck under them girders. Yeah. Duck under the girders and drills as you climb the next hill. 
then just ride on through the door, which opens as the car approaches and continue forward into a cave where the cart will stop, climb out onto the left. <laughs> Hello? Left, Brain, left! I know! <laughs> right! Right, left, right! <laughs> <laughs> Pick up the flares on the snowbank ahead on the left. Jump over to the winch. There are flares, but that's. I mean, I guess. Technically, that'd be to the left, but. Also, not really. <laughs> Fair enough. Awesome. Well, sticky keys. Yeah, Brain and Sticky Keyed. <laughs> Alright. Uh, sticky your keys. No! Wait, 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 wait. Jump over the winch. Jump over the winch. Jump over the winch. Place the lead acid battery in the opening on the side. On the side. On the side, bro. I'm gonna assume that there's. Put it yeah. on the side! Don't crank. I'm not gonna crank. Awesome. Ah! Uh, you're done. No, I'm okay. You're fucking done. No, I'm fine. It's game over. No, I'm okay. Just quit now. <laughs> I think I'm alright. <laughs> alright, hey. Uh. Uh. Place the last one on the side. Climb onto the upper platform and use the winch starter to ah. get it going. Use the winch starter. I think I already did that. Use the winchy starter. I think I already did that. Ah. Uh. In order, the order in which you use the two items doesn't matter. Once you use both, the winch activates, lowering the yellow submersible farther into the pool and also opening a door on the wall of the pool below. Now comes the hard part. A long swim through the freezing water. You'll need to do this sequence in stages, taking breaks in safe spots to get Laura's air, health, and exposure meters back up to 100% for, before diving in. Use med packs if necessary. <laughs> 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 uh. <laughs> I'm sure out of the corner of your eye just kept seeing me. Yeah, I did. I just kept seeing you wiggle. Uh, if things get especially dicey, you may be able to cheat through this using the exposure meter bug. Just don't be sure to actually save as Laura is about to freeze or drown. Stand on the winch platform near the starter handle and look over the left side into the pool. Notice the single yellow light on the wall. Dive in and swim down toward that light and into the passageway just to the right of it. I already did that. Inside the opening on the right, there's a little ledge where you can climb out. When you're ready for the next leg of the journey, position Laura near the right wall of the alcove. Face the opening, angle her to the left, and jump in. Swim down along the wall and up underneath the submersible where you'll find an, uh, an opening and climb into it. There's a large med pack inside. Uh, part of the submersible? <laughs> That's the real question. Mm, well, underneath part? Probably. It felt right. You're dead. Still not. Healies! Healies! There's a lot of mech back in there somewhere. Cool. I'll find it. Don't worry. <laughs> I can't walk off the ledge, so. Hey, 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 you went the long way. <laughs> it's not like I have anything else to do. I'm waiting for my exposure meter to go back up. It's true. Next, you're aiming for the small opening between the two lights on the wall below the sub. Drop it in the water and swim down toward those lights. And through the... If you have to save, feel free to. Yeah, no, I'm gonna. I'm, I'm lining up my next jump in. Yeetus. I wonder... Hmm. I wonder if I could just. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> this fucking face bonk. Uh, it was down worth a shot. Uh, down towards those lights, swim between them, swim through the opening, turn right into a short tunnel in, in the ice, then turn right again just ahead in an opening in the ceiling where you can climb out of your water and get a large med pack. I know where it is, so. Swan dive. <laughs> Oh, can he do it? Can he do it? No, he can't. No, he can't. He is written down. Come You're on. dead. <laughs> Come on, man. <laughs> she, she's gone belly up. That's the thing is the water, it like behaves kind of strangely. When you get to the top, there's almost like an invisible wall sometimes. <laughs> when, like You're like, I just want to go up a little bit, right? And then she won't surface. You're dead already. No. How'd you lose all of your... 
fucking heat so fast. I don't know. Then again. Oh my fucking. <laughs> she does that all the time too. I'll get to the top and I'm pushing forward and she's like, I'll do a back stroke. It's like, what? No, don't stroke your back. So. How fun. I know where to go. It's all about efficient movement now. It's all about the fish. Uh, see? See? <laughs> see? See? No. no, I just saw bad. Fuck you. I just saw bad gamer. Get a job, you hippie. <laughs> Shut the fuck up. <laughs> I might be able to swan dive from the corner of that room. You might be able to. Because it'll be like just far enough. You're already dead. You've already run out. No, 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 no. <laughs> Turn right. it up. <laughs> see and then see, see see what I mean though like there's an invisible wall and she's right there and her head is above it and everything and it's just no no and it's it's the same way opposite too Jeez. I have a hard time getting her to surf or not surface but go back down into the water you gotta start with full health probably alright I'm gonna try to swarm <laughs> Oh, <laughs> not Bonk. quite. Not quite. Almost. Almost. Same as almost last time. <laughs> Can he do no. it? No. No. Come on, dude. Come on, Laura. <laughs> the, the health bag was too much for her. It was just. It was just too awe-inspired. You're dead. <laughs> <laughs> like the worst way to get in. <laughs> <laughs> it's not any slower than the other way, honestly. You're already out of exposure. Of yeah. Uh. Not good enough. Hey. What was that? You barely, <laughs> she, she, she actually listened to you this time. I know, it's insane. Alright. Uh. Make sure your exposure meter and health bar are full before making the, the last long swim. I'm not using a med kit. Pathetic. Look how much health I'm missing. Too much. Yeah, Jump maybe. into the water and head forward into the right corner of the I little icy passageway. Now swim up a long water-filled shaft. You'll swim through a power crystal on the top. At, at the top, there's a small ledge on one side where you can climb out of the water and pick up a small medipack. Ah, medipack! Motorpack! A small one would actually hit throw me up too, I think. Yeah, right? Oh, oh not quite. Oh well. Uh execution. Climb up to the final area in the level. Apparently Willard and his cronies have uncovered more than just a few artifacts. There's a flamethrower guy here, but he's pretty much useless. From the ledge where the white suited guy is standing, turn around and face the entrance, then climb up to the opening above on the left. Kill the mutant lurking inside. Oh, I see why he's pretty much useless. <laughs> Just hang around. I think he's stuck, honestly. He's not even gonna hurt me, so cool. Hey, buddy. Ow. I go across this? Uh, crap. Uh, okay, from the ledge where the white guy, suit guy is standing, turn around to face the entrance, then climb up to the opening above on the left and kill the mutant lurking inside. Or just leave him be since he doesn't have any goodies. Then cross the bridge over the deep chasm and kill two more. Ah! <laughs> it's a good thing I, I kept reading. <laughs> yeah, it, you do that a lot. You'll stop right before the important part I care about. <laughs> <laughs> or, or not do that. <laughs> then cross the bridge over the deep chasm and kill two more mutants. One on each side of the hut. They can't swim. They can't climb without legs. So if you like... You can just stand at the edge of the bridge until they emerge, then hop back out of range of their toxic breath and shoot them from relative safety. Only relative? Right? Just take care not to fall off the edge. <laughs> <laughs> it's toxic breath. He didn't get me, by the way. He, he, he like, oh, he got I, you. I jumped over him, but he had barely missed me that first. Your health's not even going down. No, it is. It's just really slow. Jesus. It's alright, since I'm already poisoned, you can't do more to me. Can't poison you more. Right. Uh, now head past the carved stone heads to the far right side of the Look at ruins. This photo. Look at this guy. Oh my oh, god! Look oh. how surprised he looks. He's very surprised. <laughs> <laughs> Where the ledge 
uh, where the ledge where meets what the ice wall. It, two wares. I don't know why. Uh, there's a light mounted on the wall above and another ledge below. Turn around so the wall with the light is on Laura's right. You jump onto the slope next to the wall. Slide down backwards. Grab the edge and drop on the lower ledge. Go into the tunnel for secret number three. Oh, secret number three? I don't give a fuck about secrets. A large med pack, desert <laughs> eagle clips, and grenades. Ah, uh, desert eagle clips. Eagle clippies and... I have 81. That's not enough. You need at least It probably is enough. You need at least 200,000. But if you want to skip that, we can. Yeah, we're going to skip that. All right, turn to the cave opening, turn left, and take a running jump across the chasm to the small white ledge. Turn around, take another running jump across the gap to a small to a small triangular ledge ahead on the left. I think it's talking about getting back up here. I think so. I kind of think so. Climb up onto the bridge, take, take a standing jump from the raised block supporting the bridge to grab the roof of the building above the door. Pull up and walk to the back of the roof. For a small medipack. Ah! You get the small medipack. Ah! I fucked that jump up real bad. Or you don't do that. And then, so you get the medipack. I do want the medipack, because medipacks are useful, and this is infinitely easier to get. It's true. Dude, climb up there. Come on, Laura. And then, after you get that, return to the front of the building, drop down, and press the button to open the door, go inside the hut, and complete the level. Let's do a running jump? I don't know. Running jump feels right. Sure, why not? But, you know, whatever. I have infinite attempts, so... Hey! <laughs> I'm not worried about it at you all. Did. <laughs> you did it! You did it! Oh. 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 Push the button. And this is the end of the level? That is. Hell yeah! That is the end of this of this Dude. level. Oh. Uh, cool. I'm just gonna save here. Yeah. Part of the best. I like the minecart stuff. That was cool. Did you want to end it here? Yeah. All right. Well, might as well. And yeah. not worry about getting confused or anything like that. Two whole minutes in. Yeah. <clears throat> All right. Well, if you enjoyed the video, consider liking and subscribing. Definitely go check out our other content. And until next time, peace out. Bye bye.